Members of Air Force ROTC Detachment 805 at Texas A&M University and College Station welcomed Lieutenant General Darrell Robertson, Commander of Air Education and Training Command at Joint Base San Antonio Randolph, May 13th. Robertson was the guest speaker for the commissioning ceremony, and he offered words of inspiration to a group of 32 cadets. You're going to go out and you're going to do some incredibly important things. There are no extra people in our Air Force today. We are the smallest Air Force our nation has ever had right now. We have the lowest number of airplanes. We have the smallest force. So every single one of you is going to a position that is critical for our Air Force. We're going to ask you to go learn how to fly airplanes or do some specific things, but the biggest thing that we need from you is your leadership and the experiences that you have gained from here at Texas A&M during four years of hard work is going to serve you extremely well. There's no doubt in my mind. So bring it on. Following Robertson's speech, several cadets received the oath of office from family members. Do solemnly swear that I'll support and defend the Constitution of the United States against all enemies foreign and domestic. While others were given the oath by Robertson. Having been appointed a second lieutenant. Having been appointed a second lieutenant. In the United States Air Force. United States Air Force. With the help of loved ones, the former cadets pinned on second lieutenant. The ceremony represented a culmination of hard work and dedication for the past four to five years. The quality of his words and the advice that he gave us as young lieutenants is going to be something that I'm going to carry with me. It was a lot of hard work putting into this and all of us are really proud to be able to not only graduate from this great university but to also be a member of the world's greatest Air Force. Following this event, Robertson attended the university's graduation ceremony and congratulated the newly commissioned officers from across all of Texas A&M's ROTC programs. Texas A&M's Corps of Cadets makes it the largest senior military college in the country, commissioning more military officers than any institution other than the service academies. Edward James Second Lieutenant, United States Army. This was Robertson's first visit to the campus. The visit deepened his appreciation for Aggieland's traditions and its premier role in producing the next generation of Air Force leaders. Being here at Texas A&M reminds me a lot of the Air Force Academy. It brings back a lot of memories for me, similar in so many ways, but yet the, the heritage, the traditions, the history, uh, here at Texas A&M is much, much bigger than it is at, at the Air Force Academy. From the 502nd Air Base Wing Public Affairs Office, I'm Sean Schroeder.